new tonight now. The signs on one Sunnyside street make it clear that it is for one-way traffic only. But some drivers are ignoring it, and residents say they are scared for their lives. As CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports on this wrong-way danger. They go the wrong direction all the time. Living on what should be a quiet one-way street, but residents say it's more like living on the edge. Too many drivers like this one in this SUV are using 39th place in Sunnyside to shortcut away from an often jam-packed service road alongside the Queens Midtown Expressway. The driver of this white van backing up the wrong way. More brazen is the driver of this blue minivan traveling forward illegally against the traffic. We have to make sure that we're aware of people going backwards. Somebody missing me by maybe six inches. Drivers trying to shortcut out of expressway traffic over to Queens Boulevard are not the only lawbreakers. Others set aside safety in a crazed competition to find parking. Residents say another problem here, drivers see in the rearview mirror that a parking space opened up behind them. So instead of going around, they back up this one-way street. To let that spot go until you circle back, is it's tough for some drivers. That's very dangerous. Right. Queen City Council member Jimmy Van Bramer wants the Department of Transportation to add plastic partitions and pavement markings, like these one street over, to prevent wrong-way right turns. We've had this situation exist in other streets here in Sunnyside, and we're able to fix it. We contacted a DOT representative who said the area will be inspected and a remedy will be found. But until that happens, NYPD is expected to step up enforcement here and turn around this wrong way mess. In Sunnyside, Queens, Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News.